Hi everybody, you are welcome. Time for another joke on this Friday. It's a good Friday today, I think. I'm not too sure. Not that I care anyway, but I presume it is good Friday at some point, is it? Uh, by the way, if anybody has any tutorial videos on how to get a haircut, uh, by all means, do let me know. Uh, send a stamped dressed envelope, please. Or just let me know how to get my haircut, because I'm turning into a wild man of the woods here. Okay, time for our joke today. And uh, a married couple are sitting down one night. And they're approaching their 50th wedding anniversary. And the wife looks to the husband and she says, you know, our anniversary is coming up, darling. And he goes, yeah. She goes, well, you know, there's nothing really I can give you that I haven't already given you. I mean, you you know, you're a man who has everything. And it's very hard to choose a gift to give you on our wedding anniversary. So I came up with a novel idea. And he said, what? She said, well, you can ask me one question and I'll answer it truthfully. Whatever question you want, I will answer it truthfully. He goes, he thinks about it for a while. He goes, okay. He goes away and comes back to her a couple of days later on, on the day of our anniversary. And he says, uh, darling, I have thought of a question. He said, we've been together 50 years. He said, we've seven beautiful children. But I can't help but wondering how six of them are identical. Yet one is completely different. And I have to ask, has he got a different father than the rest? And she looks her husband dead in the eye. And she goes, yeah, he has a different father than our other six children. The husband's taken aback and he goes, oh, Jesus, really? That's, that's it's awful. And he goes, well, look, I'm going to ask a follow-up question. You don't have to answer, but I'm going to ask anyway. So our seven children... And that one child who looks different and has a different father. Who's his father? She looks up slowly, looks deep into his eyes and says, it's you, dear. 